Hi everyone. Welcome back to Civil Engineering Fanatics. We're going to talk about cold weather concreting, what it is, why it matters, and how we can protect concrete during those chilly days. So let's dive right in. According to the ACI American Concrete Institute, cold weather concreting happens when the air temperature falls below 5 degrees Celsius or 40 degrees Fahrenheit during the time of placement and stays that way for more than 12 hours. When it's cold outside, concrete faces serious challenges like delayed setting time, slow strength gain, and even the risk of freezing before it gains strength. That's why we need special care. Let's take a closer look at the problems that can happen if we don't follow proper cold weather concreting practices. 1. Freezing of fresh concrete If water inside the concrete freezes, it expands and damages the structure before it sets. 2. Slow hydration Chemical reactions slow down in low temperatures, which means the concrete takes much longer to gain strength. 3. Cracking due to temperature gradients. The surface may cool faster than the core, causing internal stresses and cracks. 4. Improper curing. Moisture can evaporate too slowly or freeze, affecting curing efficiency. That's why precautions are a must. Now, let's talk about the solutions. Here are some effective tips to protect concrete during cold weather. Use hot water or heated aggregates. This raises the initial temperature of the mix. Use accelerators. These are admixtures that speed up setting and strength gain. Calcium chloride is commonly used but should be avoided for reinforced concrete due to corrosion risk. Use low slump concrete. Less water in the mix means less risk of freezing. Avoid placement on frozen ground. Always thaw the subgrade before placing concrete. Cover and insulate. Use thermal blankets or insulated formwork to trap heat and keep the concrete warm. Cure properly. Maintain the concrete at 10 degrees Celsius, 50 degrees Fahrenheit or higher for at least the first three days, ideally seven days. Use windbreaks and enclosures, especially when placing slabs or working in open areas. Another critical step is monitoring concrete temperature. 1. The minimum temperature of concrete during placement depends on the element size and weather, but usually ranges from 10 degrees Celsius to 21 degrees Celsius, 50 degrees Fahrenheit to 70 degrees Fahrenheit. 2. Use temperature sensors or maturity meters to track internal temperatures and strength gain over time. Let's summarize with a quick checklist. Before you pour concrete in cold weather, is the subgrade thawed and dry? Are the forms and reinforcement free of ice and snow? Are heating systems or insulating blankets ready? Are you using cold weather admixtures? Are curing methods in place? If you've checked all these boxes, your concrete is ready to take on the cold. So that's a wrap on cold weather concreting. By following the right methods, we can ensure concrete maintains its strength and durability, even when temperatures drop. If you found this video helpful, give a thumbs up, subscribe to Civil Engineering Fanatics, and let me know in the comments what topic you'd like us to cover next. Stay safe, stay curious, and as always, build it right. Thanks for watching.